Hello, this is XSX, and today I'll be teaching, I'll be showing you guys how to use um, three new, three plugins that are pretty new to me that I've never seen. Um, they are called the one is called Teams. Um, another one is called um, I was like, what was it called again? It was all these zones. Um, it's a pretty long name, so I'm not going to be saying it. But it offers a jail, a uh, AFK system, a um, j prison system, and kill zones, um, and much more. So you you just check it out by watching watching what I do. All right. Um, so to, right now I'll be showing you the team plugin. First things first, for a team plugin you need to put make a new team. So let's just make a new team. Okay, I'll call this team uh let's let's call this team wizards. Okay, so I'm this new team called Wizards. Now we have to pick a team color. Alright, now let's check out the team chat. I guess you don't need a color. It's automatically yellow. Yep. Yeah, I guess you pick the color by yourself. Okay, I'm going to show you, uh, this plugin is pretty old, but it's very useful if you're having these, um, issues with safes and chests that people keep trying to hack into or grab your items. See, down there, it has this, it has this list of what this chest is, so, it has it has no chess owner, it's public, so anybody can use it. It's not region share. It has no password on it, and it cannot refill. Okay, let's take control of this chest. Okay, now I protect this chest. So it has my name on it, and it's not public, so that I can only I'm the only one to can access it. But what other people is like, what if you're admin and you want other people to access it? Okay, so you do this. You need to set a region. Ah, oh, crap. Wait, let me do something. Okay, we're back. I had to change some stuff since um, there's no way of you to change uh, your position, your permissions by in-game, by being in-game. So now I am. Alright, so now I'm super admin. And now I can do the region checks. Set one. Set 
set to. Okay, now this region is called test, and who, and since now, um, now I'm going to protect this region, so then only admins or anybody allowed in this region could, like, break stuff. Okay. Since I'm admin, I could, I could play stuff. Now let what? Let's see what happens if I register and log in as a different person. Okay, see this icon right here it says you can't get out of jail without reading the rules. Um. I'm not sure how to point out the rules yet, but you have to type in slash read the rules in order to get out of this area. So no matter what you do, you just get stuck. This is the jail command. So you're pretty much stuck in one place. The spawn area, basically. Okay, I registered. Okay, now I'm in. I'm free. Hey, yeah, I'm free, I think. Okay. The chest is magically locked. As you can see, the, um, you can see the owner and... Okay, now I'm in the region of test and let's see if I could put in a block. So you cannot put in any block anywhere in this region. All right then. Since we want other people to do the to open our chest right here, since it's magically locked, we use the region share. So. So to do that, we do this. Okay, now it says open a chest in region to set an or unset regional shareable. So this is our chest and we want to share it to anybody that's allowed into this region. That could like break stuff. Okay, now this is not public, but it's region share. So, non people, random people cannot like cannot touch it, but people who live in this area can. So, in order to make someone live in this area, or to make it this their house or something, to protect it from other people griefing it, we do this. The player just six is allowed to is allowed in this area. Let's test it out. Okay, here I am. Let's open that chest. And again, see, get this carrot. Summon my own pet. Cha, yeah, bunny. What's up, bunny? Okay, bunny, fly up to me. Fly, bunny. Ha ha. All right, let's see what else. Okay, now let's join the team again. See if it works.
Well, I I believe that um, in order for this to work, you need a, a more people, not just me here. So um, we'll try that on like later, with more when pe more people try want to join me. All right. Now the l next plug, last plug I'm going to show you is the AFK plugin, the uh, prison plugin. Since I already showed you the jail plugin, the jail one. So now we're just going to do the prison, the kill zones, the chest zones, the die mod area. Yeah, it's going to be pretty inter interesting. Alright, now let's set an AFK area. AFK. So let's be AFK for one minute. Let's see what happens. Oh, wait, forgot to do one thing. Now let's check what happens. And voila! I am in the AFK zone after 60 seconds. This can be useful if people are AFK and they don't want to get killed. Like, if you're AFK, you gotta do something. Um, you don't want to, like, get destroyed by something upcoming, like, maybe a boss or a goblin zombie. Gob- uh, not go a goblin army. Bah. But I guess it only, now it's like die mold area, so we'll show that right now. Okay, let's see how if a, a monster comes here. For example, hmm, the devourer. Farther away. Bam, it dies. Alright then, that's that's pretty good. Okay. Now, let's see what to do. What am I going to do next? Hmm. Well, that'll be, that's going to be all. Okay, see you guys later.